Hey team, JT Accessible here. Today we're going to be doing part two of our enhanced scans menu in Adobe Acrobat Pro DC. Today's sample document is a piece of paper we've just scanned into the computer. Um, as you can see, it has a little extra handwriting and whatnot on it. Um, we've just done the image only PDF work, and this is directly after an auto tag uh, has been run. Uh, so here's what it came back with. Uh, as you can see, it's counting this entire area as a figure. Um, we want it to read as a table. So we would just go ahead and draw that rectangle on the Touch Up Reading Order tool. And hit Table. And most of the time, we just call this a day. But the problem here is even though it's going to tell you that the table's correct, it actually isn't because instead of breaking it down into individual cells and rows all it's done is just throw everything into one big table header cell and then it's just going to read it like it was a paragraph it's not going to break it down individually take a look at here same table clear it up for you what we want is we want to see everything broken down into sections and containers like this what it's done here go to it here is it's just throwing everything into one single container and that's just not going to work what we need to do is we need to go back and this is always a fun task is throw every single element into its own table container then you have to go back with the find tool after you've done all of that and then using the find element tool tag it individually here then, after you've done all that, then you need to go into your table and they'll all be sitting there at the very bottom of your tags panel and then you have to bring all of them into individual rows and a table. You have to do that all manually in order for it to display correctly. Um, there's no real shortcut or, or solution there other than doing exactly like that. The only other thing I could suggest is try rescanning the document and see if you get a better result because what's happening is all that extra uh, stuff going on and even just the, the table dividers itself sometimes because it's coming in on a scan can actually interfere with the recognition of the document. Um, so that's what you need to do if you see that. You need to go back and check your tables to make sure that it actually got placed correctly in the containers. You want to see uh, this individual containers for everything. Um, if you see this result, you're going to need to go ahead and do all those steps again. 